Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Steam overlay on Battlefield 4. So without further ado, let's get started. Uh, first thing we want to do is go to this link. I'll provide it in the description of this video. And uh, what this guy did, Ron975, is basically made a little program or whatever you want to call it uh, called Battle Logium. And what it does is just runs battle log through your Steam and gets the Steam overlay to work through battle log. Uh, I don't know why, but si ever since Battlefield 3 it hasn't been working. I think they might have patched it or something. But um, this, this program, he actually wrote it for Battlefield 3. And it does work in Battlefield 4 really, really well. So um, what you want to gonna do uh, is make sure you have your .NET framework for. Uh, I mean, if you constantly update your Windows, you'll probably have it if you have Vista or later. Uh, obviously, <laughs> you're gonna want Origin if you don't already have that. Uh, install the w latest web plugins. You'll probably already have that if you've played before. And uh, okay, these next few steps I'll show you right now. So. What you're going to want to do is go down here and download it from his website. So just click that and make sure you download it. And then what, you, what you're going to want to do is when uh, you download it, uh, unzip it to wherever you want. I unzipped it to the Battlefield 4 folder just to keep everything, you know, in the same place. And then uh, what you're going to want to do is go to your Steam, go to Add Game, and then add a non-Steam game go to browse and then look for uh, battle logium right here uh, since I have mine in my battlefield 4 folder that's where it'll be and then just open that sucker up add it to the program list and then what you can do is you can right click on that sucker and then battlefield 4 and click play you see the little battle logium logo come up for a second there and what this guy did too is he he made it look really nice too he uh, it doesn't look like a web browser it actually looks like you know a program itself uh, one th one thing you're gonna want to do is go up here and go to battlefield 4 it just goes to battlefield 3 default for some reason uh, yeah and I'll show you a test in game right now it shouldn't take too long to load since I have a SSD. Logging in. It's loading the level up. And we're in the game. So I will go ahead and pick a point here. Take an objective out from the game.